ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ uh we're here today with uh, Ashpal Kaur Bagul she is the first Sikh female representative for England uh in the hockey so um we want to welcome her to talk about the few of the stuff the project that Sikh Youth UK do the seva that goes on in the community and just a bit about her and her sporting career so first of all welcome uh to the Sikh Youth show and um obviously how have you um you know found the sort of work that Sikh Youth UK do how did you uh get to talk to us as a team and you know uh be able to have a platform to talk to the future generations about your career as well why would you go casa why would you keep it there um firstly i'd like to say that i feel very humbled um that cq uk have brought me on board um and have given me this opportunity to come um and be a part of them and share my experiences um i actually first came across cq uk on instagram um on some posts that they were doing regarding a grooming roadshow that you're we doing um and so um i find that is a great foundation and a great platform for all the youth um all the community to be a part of get involved with um and they're doing fantastic work to help our youth now um that are out there and suffering maybe in addictions or um grooming and alcohol addictions um and helping them get their lives on track. Yeah, no, we really appreciate that. Um obviously there is a lot of work that goes on behind the scenes and some of the preventative work we work with Godware like Smedic like um in Gurwajan Dev Godware Derby East London. We work with many Godware across the country. Um how important is it like um obviously we brought you down to Smedic for this week to do uh the kids camp and be in and involved in the activities with them as today you did um a PowerPoint presentation. just let the viewers know what kind of stuff you would uh, present into the kids and how they might take something positive away from that so i see myself as sort of a role model for sikh females number 1 but also all of the sikh youth and um, i'm quite fortunate that i had family background that were very supportive um and they gave me the opportunity to sort of fulfill my dreams and be involved in all different sort of aspects of life um and i feel that being in the gurdwara and Obviously my presentation today was about me and my life achievements, obstacles, values um and what it takes to become an elite athlete. I think sharing them sort of things with the youth now and the up and coming um gives them a reassurance that there are other people out there that have been there and done it and that yes there are things that get in the way but there are also people that have them sort of obstacles but still continue. And then with the values of commitment, dedication, courage um and sort of a warrior sort of um status is to that they can make it through and make it through till the end and not to give up. That's really important obviously um uh, the camp that's been going on is about Shahid Baba Manojal and he was the last man standing he never give up so that never give up spirit is really good. Um just how have the kids been um around you like the young girls especially do they are they interacting with you and stuff like that just let the viewers know. I think the community at Smedic it's very exciting um especially the females they are passionate they're striving they are looking for uh, other things to do they are looking to be successful um and it's been great to sit and talk with a few of them sit and learn give them from some of them um and just get a feel of sort of what they're into and how it differentiates from my life um and it's about learning i can learn off them and they can learn off me yeah no definitely it's really important that um as a sporting figure as a Sikh sporting figure people like yourselves are involved with the day to day activities that go on up and down the country so obviously we give you a platform and obviously I know how you've said already you were humble and you appreciate it but the importance of that is 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 a must because these kids are going to be looking up to future role models so for them to aspire to something is so important so you to help and guide them on their journey you know it must feel great to be part of that of course i mean it's a gr- this is a great foundation and For me when I was younger there was nothing like Sikh Youth UK or the sort of community that you have here at Smedic Gurdwara East London Gurdwara Derby Gurdwara and so my generation in Leeds was sort of left just idle and maybe doing more things involved with school but not in the Gurdwara and so we were scared away from the Gurdwara so rather than being introduced in here at Ethos where arms are open to everybody all the children come they all get on with each other and you treat and you treat them with respect and you teach them to respect as well um one message I do have and it's a big message to all the other role models out there whether it be sporting or music um I don't know drama or in the sort of 
acting industry is that if you are out there and you have achieved, don't forget your roots and do come back and it's our jobs now. We haven't quite made it yet or we have made it, whether you're at the top or you're just near the top, is to come back and feed and filter what you've learned and your experiences into the community. I think that's very important. No, no, definitely. Um, obviously, uh, we appreciate you coming on and speaking to our viewers. Um, you know, obviously the positive work that CQ UK are doing and you've already endorsed that. How important is that day to day within the community? Because there is a lot of issues there. And obviously, being in the camp, you've heard some of the issues that we have to deal with. Um, you know, how important is it, the work that goes on from the welfare side of the stuff that we do in the project? How important is that in the community? Um, the level of importance is increasing actually every day. Um, but I think the main thing that shines out to me about CQ Youth UK is that all your members that are doing SEVA are all very approachable. Whereas I've been in instances before where some people are not approachable and you feel very scared. And so that's the number one main thing. And I think that's why the work you do is so effective and people feel so comfortable to come and speak to you is because you are approachable, you're understanding. And it's almost like you're not being judged on first thought or first being seen first time. No, no, we thank you for your um, uh, words, kind words today and your input. Any last message to the viewers out there? Um, I have a big message to parents is um, get behind your children and encourage them to come to the Gurdwara. Don't make a Gurdwara a scary place. Um, and if you come with them, it also helps. Don't just bring them and drop them off and leave them there and then pick them up. Come and enjoy the experiences with them, sit with them and also there's probably things that you can learn out there and CQ the UK they're doing a fantastic job in incorporating all age groups, all types of people whether you be 16, 12, 5, female or male and I really applaud the work that you're doing. Thank you very much, we appreciate your time today. Uh, that's Ash uh, Ashpalko Bogle, she's an uh, England hockey player um, we appreciate her coming back to show uh, the youngsters and to be part and support our project with these um, uh, positive career. So um, thank you for listening. Why do you Khalsa? Why do you give them?